I had lunch today with my husband's grandfather, and so I was really good. I ordered a half salad, no dressing, glass of water, and then the waitress came and asked if we wanted dessert, and he said, yeah, let's get dessert. So I ordered chocolate souffle cake. That was like so good. And I never order desserts in restaurants, and it's not like I don't eat sweets. I've shared with you before that sugar is a huge addiction for me, and like later tonight, while I'm either on the computer or watching television, I'll be eating chocolate-covered graham crackers. Summer's coming, and I'm really conscientious and, you know, of what you look like. And, you know, every day I put on a pair of flip-flops, and I think to myself, I want a pair of higher flip-flops because I don't know what it is about a higher shoe, although I really can't wear high heels, but a higher shoe that makes a woman feel thinner. It's not like it takes inches off or covers up any fat, it really doesn't. It just, higher shoes make a woman feel thinner. So the other day, I get a coupon in the mail. Um, there's this new store that opened up and it's spend $40 and save 20. Okay. Now, I enjoy shopping, but I also have a very practical side to me where if I'm not working, I really don't have a right to go be spending money on me. But spend $40 and get $20 off is really a no-brainer. I mean, I really had to at least check it out. So I go to the store after I drop my husband's grandfather off, and... Um, there really wasn't anything that I could spend. I mean, there really wasn't anything I wanted, but lo and behold, in the shoe section, there was one pair of high flip-flops for an incredibly cheap price. So I picked those up. And, and what is it about a pair of higher flip-flops or a higher shoe It's just a, a frame of mind that women get into when they have a pair of higher shoes on. 